After a clinical exam, orthopaedic surgeons often turn to x-rays. Weight-bearing views are critical. When patients stand, surgeons can evaluate the bones and joints in a functional position, making foot, knee and hip deformities and joint space narrowing more apparent. Though x-ray radiation is very low, a 2D picture of a complex structure can misrepresent the anatomy. The foot alone has 26 bones and 33 joints, and an x-ray turns that into one flat image. This leads to potential misdiagnoses, time-consuming workarounds or higher radiation lying down CT scans. Fortunately, weight-bearing CT has changed everything. Since Curve Beam introduced the first standing CT scanner, several medical journals have lauded weight-bearing CT for diagnosing several common leg conditions. These include bunions. Now surgeons can evaluate the sesamoids, two tiny bones below the big toe that are hard to see on x-ray, in a functional position. For optimal accuracy, patients should stand naturally, with both feet placed side by side, only Curve Beam's weight-bearing CT systems have a patient platform large enough for this. Looking at a lower extremity deformity in comparison to the healthy side can be critical. Weight-bearing CT could assist in designing better pre-surgical plans for joint replacement procedures through a look at the functional position of the bones. Weight-bearing CT can aid in diagnosing misalignment of the entire leg and evaluating foot, knee and hip pain. Studies show a relationship between osteoarthritis in the knee and hind foot alignment and vice versa. The benefits are clear. Weight-bearing CT is the future of lower extremity evaluation. To learn more, visit standingct.com.